the total length of it has just raised to the 10 inch. What we are really going to do this is, this is total of 30 inch. So after 10 inch, we are just going to reduce our 140 stitches slowly, two in a row. And by the time that it is just in between 15 and half, the stitch on our needle should be 120. And on 15, after 15, you know that 15 and half inch, we are slowly going to increase our stitches, which we are just going to reduce this at this period. You know that this is just going to be this curve save. This reduction is just going to give this curve save to our sweater. You know that this you also can get it. You know that rather than a straight one. So you better just save it when there is so much stitches on our needle. So let's start it how to do this. We can just reduce this at this corner also. But I am going to pick this corner to reduce this stitches. So as you reach at this corner, when you really see only two pole stitches knitted together. So, and here, where I'm just going to focus on this, cur this reduction part. So, when you really just reduce our, just um, give a shape to our, you know, that cur curve, what you really just have to keep in mind is we're not going to reduce all the stitches from here. We're just going to stitch this four from each side of it. But we also have some some stitches to reduce from this part of this and both sides. This is the reason I really kept a little bit extra here. When you resist, red, if you just reduce from this, you reduce in the place that you know that you also have to remember to increase it but those which you, you you are not going to increase on this you better reduce from this side here we also we have i have allotted only two stitches on each side which you are not going to increase but rest if you just reduce four stitches from here you have to increase two stitches on each side extra when you just do three, so that we are just going to make it you know that this also plus it should not hamper our soldier cut also so this is what you really need to keep in our mind now we have reached the other side of our back side of this needle so it decrease from the first two pull from this side and need pull uh, rest on your needle like this you're just going to make your 140 stitches to bring down it to 120 we do this on each alternate row when you really see that alternate row you do this you just need this one next time when you really need this this uh, front side do not reduce it back side do not reduce it now so one two three and next fourth round also only you are going to reduce it next time so on every fourth row we are going to reduce it mm, this is our fourth row after cutting you know that shaping our curve what you really need to keep in your mind that you really have to just give cut it on back side and front side same place you know that for a perfect size you raise now this is our second turn again i'm just focusing only and sewing you cut cutting not the pattern shape now we are at this other side of your our needle so what we are going to do this what i really want to tell you this this is our second time shaping the curve, right? If we really just do this and um, cut our, all the, our cuttings, you know, the 10 stitches from this side, 10 stitches from this side, we are just going to, this I mean, 
you know the total we are just going to 10 for 20 stitches reduction the question is what if we really just completed finished cutting before 15 inch in that condition i recommend you to knit another half inch just like that 120 stitches on your needle and then from after to 15 and a half inch you just can increase slowly increase from each side one stitch at a time suppose you finish re you this um, uh, this 20 stitches reduction before the 15 inch what you should do you must be wondering what you should do then i would like to recommend you to knit it another half inch uh, 15 and half minutes another half inch then from 15 and half inch onwards you start increasing from this part one one stitch from each side you know that to make it 128 and then once we really have it and if the length of this becomes 22 and a half 22 in total in fact and 22 and a half until by the time that it really becomes 22 and a half you know, on your needle there has to be 120 eight stitches now we have completed all the reduction on our curve shaping at this very moment we just have reached to 15 and a half inch of this length and we have 120 stitches on it now when we really increase it we need to and then we just pick this from this down one knit it and knit this also we do this on this other end also when there is only three stitches left we repeat this process until we get our 128 stitches on our needle when there is only three stitches we just pick it from the down one and knit one two three now just like this we increase our eight inches and that we have to do this three more now our size of the sweater is as you let's see this it should be 20 so it's time to cut it's time to cut arms so we're just going to 